Is it me? Or is Jeffrey just like glowed up? <laughs> Hi guys, it's Shumi and welcome back to another video. So this feels really weird because I haven't been here, I haven't been on this channel for a week. I had a week off to just kind of work on some personal stuff for me and I am back and I am feeling better than ever. So today we, this is very exciting, we are starting a new Let's Play. Now this Let's Play focuses around my current household that I was playing, but because I love this family so much and I know how much, how many of you guys wanted a Let's Play on the channel, I thought I can just put the two together. So I've already kind of set up a storyline so it will be easier for us to just jump in and not have to worry about too much. Um, so I will briefly briefly explain, I'll go from the beginning, um, because since my current household update, which to you guys was only two weeks ago, a lot has happened, like a lot, a lot has happened, um, because I went on my week off, I couldn't just not play The Sims, because I wasn't making videos, I had to play this. <laughs> um, so we have, okay, major thing, we ex extended and changed the layout of the house, um, so it now has two stories, and we got pregnant, got married, and had a child who's now a toddler, so that's fun. Um, I will briefly do the family tree. Cool, because this is, I think, getting more interesting now. Yay! Um, right, so it kind of focuses around our main sim, Abigail. I don't know if I will play the next generation of this legacy, I guess, with her or with her sister, but that's it. Um, so it surrounds her and her dad, Isaac, and her mum, Ashley. They got, um, they, I think they were married, actually. And then they had um, Abigail and them, her mum died in childbirth. Um, but then Isaac Isaac wanted to raise Abigail on, her own, on his own, um, but he was struggling a bit. So Abigail's grandma, moved in with them right okay we all up to speed um and then Isaac met she was Mizuki in the current household update but I changed her name to Claudia um and they got married a few like days ago in the game and then they had their daughter Jenny um who's Abigail's half sister so that's who the people are in the household um if I they're all at work in school at the moment um Holly as I said is their grandmother um she in the live stream we did of my current household at the time, we are making her have a fling with Paolo. Um, this is still happening. I think that they are boyf they are dating actually, but um, he caught her with a another person um, who might have had children by now. So we will have to check that one out. Actually, I think I might check that out now because um, I just want to check because. Um, no, I think it'll just be at an interesting depth to the storyline. So I hope you guys enjoy this Let's Play. I'm really excited to start it because I love this household so much and I have spent so much time playing with them. And um, yeah, I've just invested a lot in this thing. Um, yeah, so that's what's happening. Um, so he had a fling with what she called Windenburg. She wears the pink dress. She's part of the Paragons. I think she lives here. Oh my God, she had a baby. <laughs> whoopsie um okay so that's fine we can investigate that at some point if we want to um yeah so claudia is a um she's a doctor but for some reason my game's buzzing out and we can't go to the doctor career with her maybe it'll work today but i don't know um that's not working but she's in the doctor career isaac's in the business career and um abigail is about to age up into a teenager i think um her little sister's only just aged up in my game, um, but I wanted her to age up like in the first episode, but in my game, oh, I just hit my microphone, <laughs> I'm really sorry, um, my game automatically aged her up, so, because I was trying to put it off too long, so that was fun, um, but I'll take you through their like personalities and stuff. Oh yeah, also um, Holly, who is the grandma, she is best friends with Eliza Pancakes, which frankly I just think is great. Um, Anyway, so here is their little house. Should we do a house tour? I feel like this would be cute. Um, a lot of stuff has changed um, since the last episode. So here is the front door, um, just here, yeah, cool. Um, so this used to be the kitchen slash dining area. Sorry, I think I just went too far away from my microphone, but we added some stairs. Um, the living room has stayed in the, basically the same layout, I think, and the same positioning It's just kind of in here. But if you go through this archway under the stairs, which kind of cuts through, but it's the best I could do, um, you come into the kitchen. Yay. Um, this is a new, big, nice kitchen. And over here, they've got this cute little bit with a microwave and a coffee machine that they got from their wedding. Um, 
um and then we just got a little dining table here this used to be abigail's bedroom if you remember from the current household update um there's just a bathroom there i think that was there before maybe yeah and then this used to be holly's bedroom but we've turned it into abigail's bedroom with little jenny in it she's kind of looking a bit demented at the moment i have to say um you'll learn from this that i'm not very good at um the in-game camera this is her room it hasn't changed that much um it's the same room that it was um and we've just got uh holly's room there and if i go upstairs we have um isaac and claudia's bedroom little jenny's bedroom and a bathroom and then just a little like bookcase bit which you can't really see but yeah it's just a cute little bit here um this is most of the furniture from their old house before like before they even moved into this house their old one because they couldn't really afford it um also if you're wondering holly is really good at painting so she earns us quite a bit of money from that and i feel like we're nearly up to speed um <laughs> i don't want to make these episodes too long um these are some memorial flowers for isaac's um wife but we haven't buried her yet um he's still she's still um in his inventory uh i think we've got two dead sims in her inventory which is kind of depressing um and also the treadmill's out here because holly is on a health kick <laughs> that's basically what's happening at the moment um so as i said she's only just aged up so what i think we're gonna do she's just taking a shower because she got really stinky from her working out so i think how is little jenny doing jenny's quite hungry so i'm gonna get her grandma to give some food to jenny um let's give her a ham and cheese sandwich yes <laughs> um this feels so weird doing a let's play but i've tweaked with my settings so hopefully this is a lot less laggy for me hopefully it's a lot less laggy for you um also i can't fix i'm trying i'm i emphasize the trying to fix the whole headphone issue um but so far it's to no avail but we are trying the thought is there um let's just get her to stop playing with that because she is technically playing with her sister's toys um so we can where is she off to i want your sandwich love oh great um <laughs> i hate toddlers in the sims they just always mess around and i can never deal with it i love their little kitchen it's really adorable um they're living in just like this mediterranean style house i think at some point i will want a pool out here but currently that isn't happening um yes so i feel like we're all up to speed now i think i might have forgotten something i don't know all right so she's eating her sandwich um let's get her to have some lunch um she is also really good at cooking uh but she appears to be eating cake um which that is very old cake um oh it's saying it's great uh please can you eat your sandwich not play with it right yeah okay um i also just gave her this big hair because i never use it for toddlers and i thought it would be really cute um can we get her to talk to her maybe uh what can they do uh get to know her um um sorry i say um all the time it's a really bad habit um but i just did it again they are they've got quite a good relationship i think she has a very good relationship with oh no it's not that great with abigail um abigail they're friends okay they're friends um i think she is best friends with eliza yep they are best friends <laughs> um and isaac and claudia she doesn't really get on that well with um especially not claudia because she feels a bit like she replaced his, her daughter um but that's just kind of they've got a little bit of beef going on there um but that's fine i feel like for a first episode of a let's play i have a lot to catch you up on but it's nothing i can't sort out um uh jenny hasn't really had that much time to socialize with her family because she i thought someone was in our house then for a second um she hasn't really had that much time because she only aged up this morning and then her parents went to work um so we're just gonna get her to potty train her so that'll be fun um you know living that sims toddler life we also have very low funds because i just did some like tarting up of the outside of our house because it was a bit manky and i wanted it to look nice oh she's returned home with a project oh yes should we get her mum she has a really good relationship with claudia because she never really had a mum um in her life so having claudia with her is that they're enjoying their company um start working carefully she is like a grade a student yes um she does really well at school and can we get her to can we get her to help uh maybe uh assist with project yeah i think that would be a cute little activity for these guys to do together um as i said she's a doctor but it, it doesn't let me do that um she should be getting a promotion but we need to go 
for another day with her. Has she gone to the toilet yet? Yes, she has. Okay. Um, can you put her to bed? Yep. That sounds like a good plan to me. Um, <laughs> you're gonna need to pick her up though because she has she's that annoying toddler stage where they have no skills and can't do anything um but we we won't talk about that uh what project are they making hang on oh i'm currently in the shower um what project are they making can i tell or does it not say i don't i feel like it doesn't say no okay cool um so they're gonna put jenny to bed um in her cute little green room uh is she putting her to bed i think she is yeah Okay, cool. And then we're going to get her to do some painting because we are seriously low on money and it's what we need to do um, because the others really don't earn that much from their jobs. So humour and hijinks festivals in town. Oh, that would be cute. Oh, can we go on a date? Hang on. Stuff that. Um, I, because this is my legacy, I may just do a little bit of cheating of needs because I just like to follow storylines and we are trying to complete Isaac's aspiration, um, which is the soulmate one. And silver dates on two dates with spouse. Okay, cool. So we are going to ask on date Claudia and we are going to go to the Humour and Hijinks Festival, which requires me to remember where it is. Um, but I can't exactly remember that at the moment. Uh, if you are familiar with a Shroomy Let's Play, I do not take screenshots. I will try my best, but it's probably not going to happen. Right, where? That's this, like, I feel like it happens here. <sighs> I feel like it does. Okay, let's go here and we can always go somewhere else if the festival isn't there. Um, also, Claudia has a sister, which is a complete, like, subplot. Um, her sister's like a gold digger. <laughs> Um, they lived in a really fancy apartment, um, and Claudia and Isaac met because she was a pizza delivery girl. That's, that's what's happened. <laughs> um, but now they're happily married and it's just nice because Isaac didn't really have that, he didn't really have, like, a woman in his life to help him raise Abigail apart from her grandma. So that's what's happening there. Uh, hopefully this loading screen won't take too long. I feel like we'll go on this date, maybe go back to the house and then I'll have to wrap up this episode. I hope you are enjoying it um, because I took the break off because I'm not sure if I'm going to do an update video about it. I think I might do. Um, also, you won't be able to tell, but I've got a new microphone stand, which I'm very happy about. Thank you. Oh my god, our bills. You see, that is why. Oh, right, okay, we are going to be a joke person. Oh my god, who is this? Is it me? Or is Jeffrey just, like, glowed up? <laughs> He's just looking slag at the moment. I'm like, Jeffrey, who are you about to rob? Um, yay, we came to the right place. Okay, we are going to go from the jokester's side because... We're not evil. Um, we are going to join the jokesters together. This is just going to be a cute little date for them. We're not going to really um, participate in the festival, but I like the festival atmosphere. Okay, they're both in their really ugly work clothes. <laughs> we need to change that. Um, let's just change Isaac's outfit into this. And Claudia has a really cute dress that I love on her. It suits her so much. And it's just, it's beautiful. Um, so we will sort that out. I don't know where they've gone. Oh, they're just going to the bar <laughs> to drink their drinks. Okay. Uh, right. What is happening here? Have they changed outfit? Yeah. Okay. I'm just going to go get them to sit like at this table together so they can, you know, interact, get their silver date um, for his aspiration. And then we should be good. This drink looks really scary. Oh no, my dog's barking. Hopefully you can't hear that. I feel like we've got people arriving at our house to do stuff but hopefully you can't hear it and it shouldn't be too much of an issue. I will have to decide whether it impossible sausage mime. Now, <laughs> uh, oh no, they're gonna be like um, uh, playful for this entire thing because they are at the humor and hijinks festival. Great, um, oh no, don't sit there, don't, no. Oh my God. <laughs> <sighs> right, I might just try and complete some of their little like whims. I never do this. What does he want to? What does she want to do? She wants to make out with Isaac. We can do that. We can. Um, I don't know whether there's a hot tub. Oh, I put a hot tub on top of the art gallery. <laughs> Yolo. Um, because that's where I. It's a long story, but that's basically. I, 
we don't need to go into the ins and outs of that. Um, right, so sit and talk with your date, socialise with your date, be sarcastic about voodoo. Is that... That's funny, okay. Uh, gossip. <laughs> oh my god, this... I feel like there's quite a lot of lag now because we're at the festival and there's so much like happening. Um, tell your date a story. We can do that. We can. Uh, oh, it's not under romance. It's under funny. Oh, who's this guy with the plant hat? Oh my god. Tell a funny story. Sure. Um, I just want to get a silver date. That's basically what I want to happen now. Uh, but alas, it shall not happen because this Sims game is hating me right now. Um, inside joke. Um, I will want to introduce Claudia's sister into this. She has a very weird relationship with her sister. Her sister hates children, so we don't really like inviting her over because every time we do, she just destroys our doll's house. <laughs> so that's fun. Um, has she told the funny story yet? Right, yeah, we have, okay. But our socialise with date isn't going up. Great, great. That is just, I mean... <gasps> okay, I don't, I'm not enjoying this because my Sims game is not cooperating. You know when your Sims are just like, no, we're just off in our own world. That's what's happening right now. <laughs> um, deep conversation. Please just, I, I just want to get our silver date just for poor Isaac's little aspiration. He just wants his soulmate. <laughs> um, dramatic story. We just need to get up our like social interactions and hopefully we can just get this up okay okay um knock knock joke sure um just throw in s oh no you see those people have arrived now and i don't know if you can hear that i feel like you can okay hang on i'll be brb okay i'm back this is a little bit strange i'll just have to do some explanation uh, when i was recording the rest of this episode yesterday I had to go and do something and also there were some people with a very loud machine doing stuff in our house so I couldn't record the episode so I was like okay I'll come back like resume their cool date that you guys just watched but no 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 I have to I came back and I came into the game and Isaac was doing this which to be honest is how I'm feeling at the moment because look hang on their festival has disappeared these two are both late for work. I don't really know what happened. Um, so that's fun. <laughs> um, I don't know if I did, well I did save because these, I'm not sure. You see, something went wrong here. <laughs> and oh hang on, I'm just gonna move my microphone because you're in the wrong place. <laughs> um, no, I'm not really sure what happened. So we'll just have to continue pretend like it didn't happen didn't occur didn't happen I don't know I don't know what I'm saying um yeah so I hope you enjoyed that episode um I'm not gonna wrap it up now I think I'm gonna record for about another five four minutes oh hang on my microphone's leaning I need to tweak you guys sorry I've got one leg on my microphone stand that's like a lot looser than the others and not particularly happy about it <laughs> okay I think I think you're done I'm not sure whether you could hear that um, but it isn't left. Mm. Fine, centre daycare. Where the hell is she? Um, be real. Um, hang on. Why is it super speeding? Hang on, pause. Where the hell's Holly? Bring her here. She's just like abandoned. I'm, let's just pretend she went to go spend the day with her, um, and what's happened? bad answer dullest least interesting answer ever well not everyone can be interesting get over yourself um so she's i think going to get her trait i want her to get the manners trait because we have how many days until she ages up five um so i kind of want her to get that but let's get her to just do her homework because i do my homework when i get home from school and so should you okay um right I feel bad for Claudia. She's going to be doing terribly at work because we haven't... Oh, no, she's doing fine. It's just I can't attend work with her, if you get what I mean. Um, let's get her to outfits, change outfit. Let's just get her to put this on. I always make her wear that, but YOLO. Um, earn a silver on, day, on two days as well. Well, that's not what's going to happen. Um, 
let's just get Holly to get out of her gym clothes because that's not appropriate and get her into something just I don't know like this and get her to resume her painting because we're pretty low on money and we need the moolah um where is our child right here's our child um let's go hug lovingly how is Jenny doing hang on talk about day what's Jenny's I suppose she was at daycare today so it's not that big of an issue um I, w I kind of wanted to get her motor skill up but we probably can't at the moment let's pick her up and uh we're gonna potty train her because that's just inconvenient if we can't do that and then I think we're gonna get Abigail to do her project thing that we didn't finish last time is in the, uh, is in the thing to room I can't talk right have you finished your homework you are going to go work carefully on your project okay cool um she potty training her child yeah cool that's fine um these guys has finished her school project extra credit has been awarded yay she's happy about it um oh we made a castle that's cool put an inventory um then we i think are going to because i'm desperate to get her um uh manners trait up oh she's finished her masterpiece yay <laughs> um we needed that money uh sell to art gallery because we need the cash and then i would think yeah cool i think we are going to get what's her trait admire three paintings at a museum we can't do that yet but can we get her to serve dinner yeah we can uh what are we gonna have let's have spaghetti for dinner we are going to do a can we set the table set table with casual setting tan fun um and then isaac i'm going to get him to do his like work thing um so that he can oh pay the bills that's probably a good idea and then get him to do his work thing because otherwise we are going to be having our power turned off by good old Jeffrey Langram. <laughs> um, I'm going to get him to fill out his reports and then I think I'm going to end this episode here. Oh, she's looking very f Oh, as I said, bad in tab mode. I'm not even in tab mode and this is going badly. Uh, right, if you've enjoyed this episode, please like, comment and subscribe and I hope you are going to look forward to the rest of the future episodes of the series. I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> Bye guys.